Welcome to another edition of Nobody's Nona. It's now uh, late summer and it's tomato season. So these are beautiful San Marzano Roma, type, Roma tomatoes. They, they're less, less fleshy. They're, they're just more flavorful, better balanced. I'm going to make a beautiful marinara, marinara sauce with it. I'm going to be uh, uh, slowly boiling them down uh, and into more of a sauce. And uh, then I'm going to be using my food mill to process them. And initially, I've taken uh, seven garlic cloves and an onion, along with a tablespoon of some basil and some, some, chili, um, some chili flakes. We're going to uh, first take this over on the stove and uh, take care of that. And then we'll take care of this. So join me over the stove. Okay, we're at the stove with my uh, olive oil. I'm going to turn it down a bit. And here we have our onion and our seven garlic cloves. Hear that? That's a beautiful sound. So I'm going to saute that. For a few minutes until they're golden. And uh, then we'll come back to it. So join me later when this is done. So we can see here that the onions and the garlic is now transparent. So we're going to take it off the stove. And I'm going to uh, take my tomatoes, slice them in half, and put them in a large pot and just lightly simmer them down until it turns into a sauce. I'll see you then. Okay, so we can see here that there's a little part of a, like a green part at the very end. That's the part that you don't want. So just cut this out and then you can pl place them in the pot. I'm going to be uh, placing them in with some the fresh basil, of course, and uh, my dried oregano, a few other spices, salt and pepper. So let's fill it up and let's start to boil it down and will join me when it's starting to boil, okay? So can you hear that sizzle? It's, it's just starting to get it together. This is where you can put it on medium-low heat and just uh, mix it around a bit. This is gonna take another 30 to 40 minutes. So let's just let it, let it rest and uh, We'll come back to it. Okay, so here we have our sauce. We're in the semi-sauce form. Here we have the food mill. So you can, a food mill has various grates in the bottom. And yeah, it's manual work and you have to do it. There you go. And it's a bit messy. So you keep doing this until all the sauce, well, everything that can go through will go through. Yeah. Here we go. And then you combine with the other ingredients and it forms and it's fantastic. So I'm going to keep doing this. Um, join me again when it's all done. And, uh, and then we'll put it back on the stove and boil it down. Okay, so we have the last of our sauce. This is done. Here we go, let's uh, take off. There we go. That's it. It's a messy business, but it's well worth it. Okay. Great. Okay. I'm going to put this in the sink. This goes on the stove with the other ingredients. And let's bring it together, okay? I'll see you soon. This is beautiful. <clears throat> it tastes great. I'm going to let this cool down. I'm going to... Uh, put it in the fridge. The next time I use this, it'll be for an eggplant lasagna. So join me then for the next recipe we'll do. 
and nobody is known, huh? Won't be an eggplant lasagna. I'm Leonard, a.k.a. Mr. Nobody, so please join me then. Take care.